first race of the 2008 Formula One season is almost upon us, and Honda has completed an exhausting schedule of winter testing. We caught up with some of the team's key players as they prepared for the Australian Grand Prix. Three things that come to mind when I think of the Australian Grand Prix. It's the first race of the year, so which you know all the teams are arriving and it's it's dead exciting to know where you fit in. Australia is a beautiful country. It's by the sea. It's got to be one of the most picturesque races. And the Crown Towers Hotel, possibly the best hotel we stay in of the year. A great city, a great track. Um, so um, expectations are quite good. I think last year is um, a long way back. And, um, you know, we've got to put the car on the track and, and, and make it work. The racetrack itself is in the park, so it's a mixture of city track and, um, and permanent racetrack, but it's only used once a year. That creates a real extra challenge because the circuit is changing the entire weekend, the grip level. So by the race, we will be about four or five seconds quicker than in free practice. That means you always have to react with a setup and you're always chasing the, the circuit. I am excited, you know, a little bit apprehensive because I don't really know where we stand compared to the, uh, the rest of the grid. We've had a positive couple of tests when we've added some aerodynamics to the car and a few other tweaks. So I think we're going to be reasonably competitive when we get to Australia. This is the, uh, the start of a new era for us with, uh, with Ross being in charge of the, uh, the engineering side of the company as team principal. And, uh, you know, we'll start off with a very solid performance, I'm sure. But the main thing for us this year is just to continue to improve as we go through the year.